1021 The X Richmond's Rock Station. A Friday afternoon with Jason Roop and Jack Lauterbach from Style Weekly in the studio. Also, uh, a woman who goes by many names. You are a former hustler model. You've appeared on TV. Yes. And uh, what is the name you go by now? I am Sun Karma. Sun yeah. Karma. Yes, I am. And what's your real name? My full name is Sundari Karma Prasad, hence Sun for short, Karma middle name. Right. Prasad, I rarely go by. People can't pronounce it, therefore, Sun Karma. Did your parents name you that or did you change your name um i actually was named that i have an extremely uh, long name yeah um i chose to shorten it um just for that and because also i'm, I'm hindu so i decided to go back to my hindu roots and the, just keep very, some karma hey oh. i thought about going back to my hindu roots but they don't <laughs> exist so uh, t- so tell us a little bit more about yourself you're here in richmond you're from yes. richmond you've yes. traveled around the world you've yeah. been on maury you've been on the jenny jones show tyra mm-hmm. banks and now style weeklies and now the yeah. featured right. in the news and features here a, a great you're, picture of you've you. hit the big time thank you, thank you. a girl with the skull She's tattoo come back, come back home uh, yes. you've even done things like uh, auctioned ad space on your body to benefit I PETA I have um, so are you vegetarian yes I am vegan or vegetarian I am vegan okay and oh. vegan means what that you don't even drink milk I don't wow. how do you live very carefully. Yeah? The sun's rays. Seems like a yes. lot of work, that vegetarian, it, it, vegan it is. situation. You have to really look at labels and, and read and everything. Um, you know, I like almond milk and, and stuff like that, but mostly I live off of sprouts and, and, and hummus and things like that. Hmm. Another great, another fun fact here. You mm-hmm. got your sunburst tattooed on your areolas. That's right. In public. I did. Where in public? The, uh, where Rich- in, yeah, where was at I? The, <laughs> the Richmond Tattoo Convention, uh, Keely Tackett, who is a wonderful artist in Tennessee, a wonderful black work artist did that for me okay. um, when I was at the tattoo convention there. And why, why in public? Um, because there was no place else to do it. Oh, oh you oh, mean well, you just got well, tattooed? I thought you made, like you went out on a you know a statue on Monument Avenue. Oh up no, there, no, I mean and shoot, I, 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 I not to get lewd, but I mean for, you know Mason has, fee for that or something. But Mason no. has tattoos around his aerial. Is, yes, we should probably contrast and compare. They were definitely. Maybe we'll do it after. Right. What hurt, does it hurt a little bit more? I than it does. Normal it stuff, didn't yeah. because I mean you know I used to dance and most dancers have implants and I do and it and it didn't hurt because I couldn't really feel much of it. Oh okay, so you. Okay, so it's uh, all science. You started yes. it. You grew up in Richmond. You went to school here. At a certain yes. point, you realized your parents realized there was something a little different about you. Right. Uh, just like my parents, who uh, uh, initially pushed me away a little bit because of it, mm-hmm. um, and then you took off. Where'd you go? Um, I went into my own little world for a while. Um, I had to determine what it is. I was good at what it is I wanted to do. Um, when you say your own little world, what's that consist of? It's hard to explain. Um, I, I, I kind of delved more into my writing and more into myself. Okay. Um, and, and tried to figure out from there it, what it was, like I said, what I was good at. I went to VCU. I was an art student. I right. was an art history major. Um, I got a lot into the art. I started writing more about um, the art um, and getting more into poetry and things like that. And then from the art, I got more into tattoos. From tattoos... Do you tattoo? Was- I don't tattoo. You just, I just you have like a tattoos. ton of it. Okay. Yeah. Um, from tattooing, you know, I got into that scene, uh, the the uh, the tattoo artist scene, right. who was also hooked up with the stripper scene, right. who got me into that scene. Um, so then so I started you, so you dancing. Went in, you started so I getting... kind of got all wrapped up into the whole thing from mm-hmm. there. You went in, you started getting tattoos mm-hmm. uh, through the tattoo guys. We all know love, they love the strip clubs. Who doesn't? Uh, you kind of got into that world, decided hey, I can make some easy money here. You're hot right. obviously. Thank you. You started dancing and this was locally? Locally. Okay. Mm-hmm. At, what, at what point did you leave Richmond? Um, I left... Oh, I left maybe about, I've, I've been here on and off a few times. Uh, okay. I went up to DC for a while because I thought DC would have a, DC just has a, a, more of a, a culture. I mean, different people from everywhere right. are up in DC. So I figured I'd go up there for a while, kind of get an idea of. And what were you doing there? I mean, how were you, how were you living? Writing. I was writing. You were writing. And mm-hmm. now you, it says here you've published like 16 books. I have. I have. What are you writing about? <laughs> I, you know, I, I actually um, have a background in psychology as well as art. Okay. So I did a lot of my um, books on research, um, on schizophrenia research, wow. alternative treatments for schizophrenia, because, you know, I was into the whole vegan, vegetarian thing for right. a while. I don't know if you can see this, Mason, but from my side, um, there are a couple uh, vampire marks, oh, yes. bite marks tattooed on your neck. I do. I have them. Yes. What, what's that about? Big Twilight um, fan? I, uh, no, uh, vampires don't glitter. Thank you. Oh. 
Oh, um, wow. No, See, I wouldn't I, know. <laughs> Duh, Mason. I got into the whole, <laughs> uh, when I was in our art history, I got into the whole goth scene. I was one of the first ethnic uh, goth models in the Richmond area and, and online um, for right. quite a while. I used to call myself um, Blood Sister, which if, is not mentioned in, in the style. This is another one of these names. Um, DJ yeah, Shoddy yeah, reporting. That's style yeah, yeah, that show. Yeah. Wow, you guys really missed the boat and, on that one. And you, and you said you read uh, read a vampire book pretty early I, on. I read, when I was four, uh, my first, my, my aunt was a, a, in education. She taught me to read when I was three. Um, and they gave you a horror book. And they gave, <laughs> <laughs> they gave me Dracula. Thanks, they gave Auntie. me Brown Circus Dracula. I read it from cover to cover. I didn't understand some words. I fell in love with it. I fell in love with the whole gothic, you know, Dracula vampire um, type of culture. And um, it's something I, I've, I've always wanted vampire bites. And I hmm. got them. I, I want vampire fangs eventually. I'll get them. But it's one of those when you would, Did wow. you say you want vampire <laughs> fangs? I do. Like I, you would have veneers I want, put on. I want veneers put on, yes. Hmm. And you would wear them normally? Yes. Why? Wow. Because it's cool. Wow. Is it cool, though? I think it's cool. Okay, well, I mean, I guess a few things. I, cool. I immediately Here's... think, I don't want to put my penis near this. Oh. <laughs> they wouldn't be that sharp to puncture your penis. Uh, come on, you got I don't know. I mean, sharp. your teeth you have right now could probably puncture. You know, <laughs> yeah. I mean, well, I don't know. It, it is very interesting. Jason, you, you're an expert on teeth and <laughs> penis puncture. Oh, man, this is... You are I'm quite the... Uh, I'm a little scared. You are quite the uh, character here. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I'm what just you... trying to figure out what's at, what's at the end of your road. What's your goal? Like, for me, my goal is to be... Uh, you know, a hugely su successful radio DJ. You seem to be doing that already. Yeah, well, at twelve <laughs> in Richmond. Let's be honest. Uh, anyway, uh, <laughs> did uh, he's a wonder kid. What's the uh, what's the goal? What's your end goal? Where, like, where, are you, where are you trying to go? I like I said, I want to bring. Uh, real art, real culture, okay. uh, back to Richmond. Um, I don't want, you know, only New York and Atlanta and California to be the places, you know, for all the artists to congregate. I want Richmond, Virginia, RVA to be another Chelsea, another, right. um, you know, you know, another, uh, uh, I don't want to say Fort Lauderdale because they're not that great. But anyway, so what you, you what want is you, you, th you want a whole bunch of people I who want really just, the you center. know, work of okay. part-time jobs and don't do much with their lives no. to sit around and paint all day. <laughs> No, <laughs> I'm no. totally kidding with you because I'm I an know. artist too, and I got you. I just yeah. like you hard time. You want to shake up? The I want. Right. I mean, Richmond needs a quote, uh, a Batman movie. This town it needs does. An anima. I agree. We need uh -huh. a very rough, hard, um, and Easy. acidic. Need a rough, hard enema. Yes. Anima. <laughs> because only this, fun way to do it. Mm. Yeah, th this place needs to be shaken up. Sun Karma in studio Wait. with us today. She is uh, featured in Style Weekly this week. Former hustler model. She wants to shake up Richmond. And be the queen of Richmond, of course. She will have to fight Jason Roof for that title. Uh, Jason, <laughs> what and, is going we, on? We, First, we have a birthday party we want to mention, we do, too. We do. We, yeah, go, go ahead. Your, go to your website My, for your birthday. Yes, uh, by the way, sunkarma.net is where you can find me if okay. anybody wants to find Unless you want to Google me, and I'm everywhere if you Google me. Um, but I am having a birthday party. Um, it's it's my 30th <clears throat> birthday. So, um, yeah, yeah, it's your 26th. Man, I mean, things. honest to God, you guys, really look at her. She, <laughs> what what does she look like? According oh, to somebody 20s. on the website, I am middle aged and Jersey Shore ish, and I should give it up. But you know what? I'm sorry if I can I say this online. Say whatever. Um, uh, on it. radio, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> um, anyway, the haters. Uh, yeah. I'm having a birthday party at Scene Asia on uh, June 27th. Everybody that's listening is welcome to come. Um, is like it okay I said, for me as a cracker to come to Scene Asia? Yes. Okay, I'm just making sure. And, I don't want to. Crackers are, are welcome. Crackers, cracker. are welcome. <laughs> crackers are welcome. Very cool. Okay, yes. so and you. Uh, now, are you doing anything this weekend before we get to let uh, the queen, um, the real queen over here of Richmond, tell us this, what's going on? Oh, this weekend, um, I'm just, <laughs> I've got a lot of writing to do. I'm working on my, my latest book called The Penis Diaries. The penis um, Diaries. Oh. oh, if my penis had a diary, my God, that would be a, that would be a horror, horror no, story. I, I, well, I, I a mentioned, story? I'm, yeah, this, I'm working on two major art installations where I'm doing castings of penises and vaginas. They're going to be sick. Are these penises six, and vaginas six, you've experienced your, yourself, like, you know, no, made to I scale? Mean, I have, I know people in the industry who are going to uh, uh, volunteer their penises and, will you, and vaginas. Jack, would you volunteer your penis? Uh, I mean, it wouldn't be much to look at. <laughs> she, said, she said the industry, like the porn, yeah, oh, the professionals. Okay. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. I gotcha. All you have to do is just cast your penis. Mold, you know? Just plaster it. Um, right. But it's going to be six foot tall. It's going to be huge. And I just need a place to put it. Well, very cool. Well, <laughs> give us your website one more time. It's sunkarma.net. She is very sexy, uh, multi-ethnic. You. You're, not, you're not black, are you? I'm everything. You're everything, which, I, which actually, let's be honest, Probably the best looking chicks are mixed. 
Yeah, definitely. Yeah, you you got to have a little yeah, bit of everything absolutely. in there. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, well, thank you for coming in, Jason. Thank uh, you. What yeah, do we thanks. got? What do we got going on this weekend, my man? Oh, geez. Well, uh, we have the uh, drive by truckers. I might be heading to that tonight, and then well, next Browns week. Island? I, really, I really want to invite everybody to our bar guide launch party that Jack and I have been working on a lot on the past mm-hmm. few weeks. It's uh, next Thursday at Off the Hookah. Is this basically yeah. the Is situation? Any place hookah, I'll be there. Yeah, yeah. It'll, <laughs> it'll be six to eight. Everybody's invited. Come on out next Thursday. Great. Is this the situation where like it's like the service industry, like all the bartenders and all, all the, the yeah. Let's, yeah. Put it, let's be honest. Be there. Hot bartenders in mm. Richmond are going to be there. Oh yeah, yeah. I I can guarantee that. Sometimes I'll tell you, having a girlfriend, boy. It's uh, <laughs> it's no picnic. It's no picnic. You know what I'm talking about. Yep. So, and by like, the way, um, I'm single and uh, wow. You're wearing wearing a wedding ring. I noticed uh, that. Honey, I wasn't going to bring it up. This is a rock. Just to I ward off to all wear, the, the stalkers. Ward off all evil. <laughs> oh, oh, it's, a, okay. it's a non-evil rock. It's and here's rock. a question for you. You've I, I, been around. I'm also single, son. Uh oh. King and queen of Richmond. Yeah. Of course, I have to. No, this is not Richmond. I'm scared, but it's kind of it's a new it's a new liberal world, ladies and gentlemen. It's the queen and queen of Richmond. Oh man. All right, so. You're going to go out on that, aren't you? Yeah, Friday cheers tonight uh, going on to Browns Island. Uh, you got your style weekly party. That is next weekend. Next next Thursday. And uh, one more time on your website, tell people where they can see your tattooed nipples. Sunkarma.net, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> thanks, thanks, thanks for coming in, son. Thank thanks, you for son. coming You're in. Welcome, featured, thank you. in, featured in Style Weekly this week. Pick up your episode or your, uh, or, what do you call these things? Uh, the issue's good. Yeah, the episode. Or, uh, Pick up I your like episode, episode yeah. or your issue. We at, had an episode. You know, are these in public bathrooms or something? <laughs> they end up there sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks for coming in, guys. Thank you. Thank you.